Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video I'm going to be doing kind of a um, recent favorite videos. I don't want to put this as January favorites just because January has not ended yet but I just kind of wanted to hop on here, film a little video, show you guys a few of the products that I have been loving lately. Now I am wearing absolutely no makeup on. That is because it's currently winter in the south and my skin is like turning into like very like dry patches because especially during this time of the year my skin is extremely dry so I have to use a lot of moisturizers and when I got home today I just took my makeup off because I just could not deal with it anymore so that's why I'm not wearing no makeup on I know I look a little crazy but just excuse that and so yes in today's video I'm showing y'all a few of my favorite things. These aren't really skincare products, some are makeup products, um just a little bit of everything. Um I have about maybe eight or nine things. Um that I'm going to show y'all. So before I hop onto the video, I do want I do want to tell y'all that I am having a YouTube giveaway that is happening right now as you're watching this video. So if you have never watched any of my videos before, my name is Leah Kate, and I film makeup related um, videos. And I am having a 200 subscriber giveaway. So if you are not subscribed to my channel, then click that subscribe button down below, and you could be entered to win a one of Jaclyn Hill's Morphe palettes. I'm just gonna hop over here and I'm just gonna show y'all what it looks like. So this is my personal one so it's a it's a little dirty but this is what it looks like and it's just one of Jaclyn Hill's one of the one of the four um palettes that I will be giving away. Now if you do if we go over maybe 200 subscribers maybe between like 250 to 300 that I'll be giving away two to two different lucky people. Um so share with your friends if you're not subscribed then don't hesitate click the subscribe button it's free and yeah so without further ado let's just hop onto the video my favorite skincare line is CeraVe and I did talk about CeraVe the brand in my last video well not really I think it was my last video when I did the skincare and um, I did not talk about maybe I did talk about this product but um, I wanted to hop on and kind of like include this in here because my skin is very dry and this moisturizer is very intense so it intensely moisturizes your skin um, and it kind of I don't want to say it has that numbing effect but like when your skin is so dry and it's cakey and it's peeling you just want something that's like numb that kind of calms it and kind of just kind of relaxes and soothes your skin. So this is the Elta MD Skincare Moisturizer. So it's a long lasting superior, superior hydration. And this is what it looks like. Um, I think I got this at my dermatology dermatologist um, like a year or two ago because my skin had broken out extremely bad. And um, I needed some new, a new skincare. So this is what I got. And it was, um, got this at my dermatology. Will it pick up? I don't know if it will. Anyway, this is what it was. And I love that. I don't really know how much that retails for, but everything that I talk about today, I will be linking it down below. Um, so the next thing that we're going to talk about is this is the Becca First Light Priming Filter. Now, I do love this. I do not use this necessarily as a primer. Um, I use this to kind of brighten my skin and kind of give my face more of like a hydrating look. Um... So it can feel really hydrating, hydrated and refreshing. So I will apply this after my moisturizer, my morning moisturizer, and then I will go on with the primer. Now my skin is very dry right now, so I don't want anything that's going to be more of a matte finish just because it's going to irritate my skin. And I don't want nothing that's going to make me feel more matte and drying than I actually am. So my favorite drugstore primer, this is the um, Step and Glory the one heck of a blot instant perfecting um power primer shine block 12 hour and it just like shrinks your pores so it kind of makes your pores like non-existent and that is why i love this primer it is awesome and i believe this one is like 14 dollars at ulta now i know that's not like the ultimate like oh my gosh that's so cheap but it's it actually is a big bottle and it really lasts you longer than what a normal like like what a normal like drugstore primer would last you um but yeah this is the bomb so the next thing that i have been loving and this is i know that this foundation is a has a matte finish so you're not really gonna want this um, if you are like very dry but that's why i like to use a illumin illuminating Something that's going to make my skin very shiny because I am dry. 
some is shiny and then a matte finish. It just goes together and it just has a very nice finish on my face. So I don't ever go in with a matte primer and a matte foundation or a shiny primer and a shiny foundation. Um, just because that doesn't look good on my skin and it kinda wanna, I kind of want to like um, balance it out. So that is why I pair the this primer with this foundation. So this is the Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation, and I'm in the shade 0.5. I'm light, y'all. And so um, I have loved this. It's not a buildable found. It's not a buildable foundation just because it's already matte, and that's what I like. I like about it because I feel like with buildable found, buildable foundations, like you want a full, you want like a full coverage, and you keep on like putting it on your face, and it's just making it more like cakey. And I just love like already it's matte. And I don't have to use so many layers of it for it to be a matte finish and or a full finish. So that's why I like this. And this is like 40 something dollars. I don't know, but like I just I bought I've like I've had this probably maybe three or three months. And I just bought another one that like maybe like a two weeks like two weeks ago. And I'm still using this one. So it lasts you a long time if you use appropriate an appropriate amount love that so the next thing that I'm going to talk about and this is the Morphe continuous setting spray and I am almost out of this I did buy this like two weeks ago but I think it's because I've used so much of this because I love setting spray so and I just love like y'all I'll, I'll, I'll show y'all if y'all can see this but it's it's a spray I just put that on my camera it is a like it's a mist and so that's why I like it because usually setting sprays, they just like squirt at you. And I just don't like that. I love like a nice, like a mist that kind of makes you feel like refreshing. So that's why I like this one. And this is, gosh, I don't know, like maybe 10 or $12. I don't know. But don't quote me on it. But like I said, all these products will be listed down below. So y'all can shop the links that I have provided and all that fun stuff. So next thing I'm going to show y'all. And I actually did film a YouTube video, a tutorial on this palette, maybe two videos ago. I'll link that video down below so y'all can just click it and watch it. And it is, this is the ColourPop, it's a designer collection, so it's a Disney collection. And my best friend got this for me for Christmas, and I just cannot love her anymore. But um, it has all the princesses. They've signed it all, and all the colors are Disney themed. Like there is Chip, there's um, a Grumpy, there's Fairy Godmother, there's Prince Charming, Enchanted Rose, Poison Apple. There's so many Disney themed colors, which I love. And this color, no, it's this color right here. It's my absolute favorite. It's called Prince Charming, and I pretty much use it every day. So that's probably gonna be the first color that's gonna be like gone really soon because I use it so much. But I don't know how much this retails for, but I will link it down below if I can find it so y'all can swipe it um, and click it and shop it. And yeah, I posted this on my makeup page and one girl commented and said, oh, I wish I like would have like got it. But I've heard that this palette goes really fast. Like when they, like when they put it out, like it just runs, it goes out of stock really fast. So if this one ever goes in stock again, um, make sure y'all get this because trust me, it is the best palette ever. It has a lot of matte shades. Well, honestly, it has maybe like five matte shades. And then the rest are shimmer shades. So if you're a shimmer kind of girl, then this palette is for you. Y'all look at that. Love it. Anyway, so love that one. So the next one I'm going to show y'all is this is eyeliner. And this is the BH Cosmetic Liquid Eyeliner. I have used this eyeliner for probably a year and a half. No, not a year and a half. That's a lot. Probably almost a year. And I have went through so many tubes of this because it is so cheap. And it's just, y'all, it's just the best. And it doesn't smudge. And it's just ultimately the best the best eyeliner ever. So this is the the, the tip. And it is, I would say it's a, like a fine point. That's what the tip looks like. So it's it's not a it's not like a fat. Okay, okay, okay. It's not a fat tip. So it it gives you all of the precise um the line. So you can like create like a wing really well. And I believe this one. I think that they upped the price on this one because I feel like I used to get it for like five or six dollars but i feel like it's maybe like eight or nine now so i feel like they have upped the price on this but i was still i'll still pay for it because i can't usually find like good eyeliners for cheap that i like and it has the right point that i like so i love this one you guys 
And then I think this is almost second to the last thing that I'm going to show y'all. And this is the Huda Beauty, the lip stripe. And this is in the color Mystical. I received this in my Ipsy bag maybe in November or October or November. I know it was a while back. And I was like, what the heck? Like, what kind of, like, lip color is this? But it is so pretty. And, like, it kind of has, like, a unicorn, like, like vibe to it. I'll, like, swatch it y'all and I wear this every day I never thought I would but I'm honestly probably going to like be re like buying this again when I'm out or really just buying this just because I want to and have another color in it so this is the color and it is just a pink like a purple with like a pink tint to it it is super pretty I, look I'll wear it for you guys for y'all so y'all can see so it's nothing that's like too crazy but it's just such a pretty color i love it so much so y'all can kind of see love that and i think i looked this price up the other day and i think maybe it's 18 dollars it's it is that price because of the brand huda beauty and that's this is a really good brand i know their eyeshadows are like bomb i've like heard that watch reviews on them so i think the only reason like why you're paying them is paying for it that much it's probably because of the brand um i would love to try this so um when i get the opportunity i'm definitely going to be buying another color i was actually on on the sephora app like yesterday and i already have like a few colors picked out so i'm definitely going to be Purchasing this and trying it in a few other colors. So the last thing that I have, and this is not a makeup related product, it is a hair product, and this is the I believe it's called the Joico. Um, I think that's how it. I think that's the name, and it's called. It is the Daily Shine and Protect Spray. So I don't want really to say this is a heat spray, but it leaves my hair very shiny. I'm going to read to you what it says. It says this daily leave-in instantly perfects hair as it protects against fading and damage for shinier, stronger, softer strands after just one use so i will just like spray this in my hair and like right before i straighten it so it kind of just leaves my hair very like shiny and soft and beautiful so i don't know how much this retails for i will link it down below but for black friday i bought like a whole box of like hair care stuff and I will link my Black Friday video down below so y'all can go watch that one and see um, the pack that this came with. So thank y'all so much for watching this video. I hope y'all all enjoyed it. And do not forget, you guys, that I'm having a YouTube 200 subscriber giveaway. So when I reach 200 subscribers, which we're like 12 away, like I know we can do it. I will be giving away one of Jaclyn Hill's Vault Collection palettes. Now, it's not going to be, it really depends what they have, but this one is the Ring the Alarm. I'm not sure if I'm going to give this exact palette away just because it really just, it just boils down to what my Ulta store has. So, if they have um, this one, then I'll probably get it, but if they have more, then I'll probably just like a poll or something and like let y'all pick um, which one. But... I'll be giving away one of these beautiful palettes, and if y'all, if we just, like, have more than 200 subscribers, then I'm probably going to be giving away two of them. So, they're really good palettes, they're very pigmented, and I just honestly just love them, and I cannot talk good enough things about them. So, if you want to win this beautiful palette, all you have to do is be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Um, so all you have to do is, I will have a link down below to my channel, but all you have to do is just click that button down below and it will automatically just subscribe you to my channel. If you want to get notified every time I upload, then you can just click the thing right next to it and that is the bell and that will notify you every time I upload a new video in the future. And the second thing that you have to do is comment on my giveaway video um the giveaway video is maybe like three or four videos um down on my page but i will link that video down below also and you can watch that video to see how you can enter into the giveaway but really all you have to do is be subscribed that's the main thing and then on that video just comment on any uh, videos that y'all want to see in the future it's just really easy just something to give back to you um all of my friends who have supported me along the way and that is all i have for you today and i will see y'all in my next video bye y'all